One, two, three, not it. Well, well then. A duck opinion. Zombies! Now the last steps, which this will take a while, but if you guys do it like we did it, it it'll be pretty simple. You have to come down here in the chamber where you put together the staffs, and you have to punch them. And if you punch them about 30 times, as you see, you get this little white chip, and this little white chip upgrades your punch. And if you're holding a staff, when you get your punch upgraded, it'll give you an element with your punch. So now when I punch, it freezes them and it destroys them. Now all four players have to have their fist upgraded. So what we did is we got two players to go out and run circles and to keep zombies, and two players down here that would punch. And then when they got their fist update upgraded, they would switch with the other players, and the other players would come down here and punch, and they would get theirs. Like right there, you see he got his. And that was the last one we needed to get upgraded. So now we move to the very last step before completing the Easter egg, and um, yeah, it's pretty simple. We have to go to the crazy place, and we have to put all the staffs up in these particular areas. Here, I'm putting mine up. And we literally have to just hold out here and collect souls for the final time. And I basically let them just go out and run circles and let me handle it in here. Let me take care of the souls just because it just seems easier that way so we aren't all crowded in here. Because it is kind of a tight spot. I'd recommend doing it just in the center because that way you have an area to actually run. Because usually the walls will just block you and you'll get stuck. But after about a couple rounds and about 70 zombies, that happens. So you get the achievement, 75 gamer score, little loss score, but we're not done. Make sure to have the Maxis drone when you come in here. If you don't, you can go back and get it, it's no worry, but the Maxis drone is what's going to unlock the last part of this, this Easter egg. I mean, you're done, you can just go play if you want, but unleashing the drone does this. So he's like, I must go to my daughter, all that stuff. So he goes up there, he goes to his daughter and releases the portal. And we have done it. So I'm gonna go up to this portal and hit X and it'll end the game. So I don't know why my gl mind glitches there, but what Sam says is she's like, oh my god, I'm free from a Galter. All your dreams and wishes will come true or whatever, and then nothing happens. So she kind of lies. But <laughs> that is the end of the Easter egg. And if you do it correctly and follow these steps, you'll be able to do it correctly and you'll get this end cutscene. And uh, we did do a video about this in cutscene already, but you guys take a look at it just in case you missed it. Opened, the four heroes were rewarded with riches beyond imagination. From that day forward, they knew that Samantha would keep them safe forever. Getting everything wrong. I told you before that I should be blue. It's my turn, Eddie. I can do whatever I want. But you don't even know how to play properly. Girls don't know enough about zombies. What's the choice of me, children? Make sure the windows are locked before you come down to the basement. You'd better do what your dad says. I didn't even get my turn. Tomorrow, Eddie. You get to make the rules. I promise. Come on, Fluffy. I wish the heroes in our stories were real, Sam. I know what you mean. But we will make everything okay. My dad says he has a plan. So that was the egg. If it helped, give it a thumbs up. And I want to thank my buddies uh, Mystic, aka Rad, my buddy uh, Sub, which is Rob, and my buddy Killer, which is Jose. They helped me with the Easter egg. They're really, really beast mode, and we appreciate it. So uh, like the video if this helped, and uh, we'll be bringing more Origin Zombies soon. Talk to you guys later. Dust can fly. Peace.